Okay, this is a coffee pour over. Now, a lot of people question me about how to use them when I have them for sale. So I figured I'd do a video and show everybody. There's two parts to this cup. There is the funnel, which is nothing more than a cup with a rim and a couple holes in it in the cup itself mug whatever shape you like to make is fine the top should be like a funnel with a rim on it the rim should fit inside the pot the, the mug itself they sell these filters at the supermarket and by large packs they're for small coffee makers you need one filter open the filter up place it in the funnel I use one scoop of coffee I have a pre-measured scooper you may have to figure that out on your own I'm not sure how to figure that out for you okay one scoop of coffee into the filter to determine how much water you need you need to fill the cup up and pour it into a measuring cup and either microwave it or put it in a pot on your stove to boil it the water needs to be boiling hot once you get the coffee in the filter and everything set up all you need to do is pour the water onto the coffee grinds and let them sit approximately 30 seconds and that will let the coffee blossom or bloom and it gives you a better tasting cup of coffee and this cup holds approximately two cups okay so I'm going to Brush the procedure here a little bit. I'm going to finish pouring the water into my filter. Slowly pour it. It'll fill the funnel. You don't want to overfill it, but you want to just keep a nice steady flow going so it's running over the coffee grinds. And this is creating a very, very tasty cup of coffee. And it's a personal cup of coffee for one person, which is a nice feature. If you have friends over, it's kind of something interesting to show them and to give them a drink. Okay, so that's all the water you need. Let that drain through. And any percolator coffee will work, fresh ground coffee of any sort. You can grind your own beans, however you choose to do it. If you grind your own beans, it's a fresher cup of coffee. As you can tell, that it's still draining through. And it takes a few seconds for it to get all the way through the, the funnel and the, uh, the filter and the coffee grinds. You look inside, you can tell when it's finished. There's still a small puddle in there, so we need to wait a few more seconds. And it's just about empty now. I don't see any more dripping, so that's done.
and that's what that looks like. You can discard this and serve this to your friends. One fresh brewed cup of coffee. Thanks for watching.